Need stop. Need stop. Howdy, Scary Gary here. It's time to do another neat stuff. And this one's going to be specifically about how to stay clean in a possibly a dirty shower. Most of us that have got that have RVs, we have a we have a we have a bathroom in here, so why would you ever want to use the shower that's in the campground? Well, I can tell you one reason I want to use a shower in the campground is because I don't really fit in my shower. Um, we've had our camper for going on three years. I have taken three showers in our shower, and I really feel kind of like a sardine trying to roll around and get clean in it. So my answer to the problem is to go up to the shower. Now, unfortunately, the same reason why everybody's got sh showers in their RVs is the same reason why maybe they don't keep their showers up as nice as what they used to keep them up. Because you can find some places that have absolutely the best showers, better than you probably maybe some people have at home. But a lot of places, they fall in disrepair. And one of the first problems is there's no stool, there's no bench, there's no hooks, there's no anything. So my first thing that I would like to call as a neat stuff is we're going to take a bag up there that's going to hold all of our stuff in it. So that gives us an opportunity to at least hang it up, keep it off the ground, this type thing, if it does have a hook. And I kind of like these bags that are, I think I got this at Home Goods, and you can see it's really small, so it folds up, but it also, it pops open, so it is very large. And in this bag, because of the problem of having no hooks on the wall or hooks that are broken, I have gotten some of these little plastic hooks that fit right over the top of the wall. So then you're able to hang your bag, your towel, your clothes, your whatever. And I got one that's pretty large, has two. And I got a small one that's also got two on it. But this gives me plenty of areas to hang up, hang a towel on it, hang your pants on it, your shirt, the bag. It gives you a way that uh, you can keep things off the floor, which, let's be real, the floor, you really don't know exactly what's what's been on that floor. And there is sometimes you can look down there in campgrounds and it's basically gotten, <laughs> I think the bear was in the, in the shower before I was in it because it just looked like that... Uh, the, I was taking a shower on the ground versus on, on something that was possibly a shower pan. Which leads me to the next thing is wear some flip-flops. Uh, I did this, I was, I did a lot of athletics when I was younger. I wore flip-flops every time I took a shower in public showers just to keep from getting the athlete's foot, other diseases, and it keeps you not touching the dirty floor. Unfortunately, when you're wearing the flip-flops, I don't know about you, but I do put my pants on one leg at a time. And that means I've got to put my skivvies on one leg at a time. So when you're wearing flip-flops, it's very hard to put your skivvies on. So, I got a little well, uh, mat that you can just lay on the floor. It's rubber on the one side. It's nice comfy bunker on this one. So this side, you can actually wash it off afterwards. Or, and all of these things fit really nicely right in my little bag that I've got, which I keep in the camper. A towel could go in here, your shampoo, your clothes you're taking down there, your shaving. Uh, it just makes it very nice that you can have it and just hang it up and hopefully keep clean. 
So there's no reason why you have to be dirty when you're camping, even when you don't use your own shower. I hope you enjoy, and I hope you see you next week. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Turn on your post notifications. Put the comments down below. Subscribe and you'll make me happy.